Where we're going to be with Harlow Wednesday afternoon, the 11th of May, and I'm in the back of the Brown Pet Cemetery by the Columbus, Port Columbus, Ohio. And back here was a uh, Wonderland, and there's just so many fences, and uh, the security wonders what you're doing. Um, I want to keep that low key here today, and you know, the security might even help you have access, but um, there's, all the houses are gone, and if you Google the Wonderland subdivision Columbus, it says that they were cabins, and in the 70s, the airport bought all the land and tore all the cabins down. They called them cabins, I think. Summer cottages, which, and it says during the Depression in 1930, they became year-round, how they do. But really, it was just an, a poor section of Columbus, but booked kind of like in a utopia way with the Wonderland street names. Um, they kept the church, and the church is still there. I could drive down the street, but it's just a fence, and it's kind of grown up around the fence. And all the streets are out there, I think, if you if you Google it. The airport keeps it well mowed, and I'm sure there will be a big expansion someday. And of noise complaints even, where... So that that's back here, and this is a good vantage point to get a grasp on uh, what happened. And there was a flooding issue, and... Here's our uh, big walnut creek, and Harlow is really going for what's over there. Come on. Yes, there are critters. Harlow? Um, kind of all your garbage gets pitched over the ravine, it looks like. Come on. We're going back to the car. Um, sure that one will show up. Another Buster and Tootsie with no day. There's the one that's shaped like a drill bit, a pitch pine. They have that vanilla bark on them too, don't they? Sexy bark. That's where that chirping time come from. And that would make good mulch. Snooky. Yeah, that was one of the best dogs we had, I think. We had a basset hound. And they have a Basset Hound show here. Yeah, someone's arranged all this kind of to get organized for a minute. And Scrappy. Dotty Duke, another Duke, and a Mickey. Long. That's pretty. I like the way they scribed that in. And another one. Pretty stones. Like the stone. On this edge. Um, the car's up yonder. Wow. 1912. Oh my gosh. Sugar. Nappy and Sally. There's a few Sally's. I think Sally was over here now. They have Sally over here now. Mitch, Pinky, Rowdy. Yeah, those stones, um, I think the idea was they saved them from going over the creek. Yeah, those, those used to be. I'm just sketching that too. I'm probably right. Huh. It's nice to be back here, and I have to admit, the first time I came back here, I was scared of something else. And
I had my mom with me and she wandered off and I, I, I lost my mom and yeah, this place is off the charts spooky the first time you come and your mom disappears. I think I'll walk over towards the left a little bit. Now let's walk to the right. I wonder what this is over here. There's one with a chain around it and everything. We're not going to go that way though. This looks like maybe where they had to water at one time. This is one that has some feature photos somewhere or another. I've seen it. And I missed it when I was in person. Maybe it's been painted recently. Unique. Back three one. Gypsy, another Toby, Patsy, Bobby. This is the, towards the clover leaf at the end, like the thumb. And back over here to the newer part, Pudgy in 1948, Laddie. This one looks new, like that might be the one. Champion Lab Field Trial Competition yeah, That's pretty sweet. There's a Spurlock over here Yeah, more recent ones here Randy, you're a fine girl. Kind of a makeshift plaque there, booty. Classy. Come on, Harlow. Sammy, our beloved Beagle. Let's see. Kind of have them surrounding this um, dead tree stump. Oops. Yeah, that's hard work moving around this fast on a hot day. 
Get, we were up pretty early and got a lot done before it warmed up. Yeah, a beautiful memorial. Pretty awesome dog, wasn't it? That's what, uh, a Shetland, that's what that was, a Shetland. Man, those are smart dogs. Okay, yeah, that's the epoxy where something come I, I was like, is that a fossil? Huh. Come on, Harlan. Skipper. Come back, we, we kind of walked in part of this area, but... Yeah, the ground level is just kind of um, homogenous. compared to above ground but it you know serves a purpose to it. It's easier to maintain, that's for sure. Yeah, but real challenge back here. And uh, yeah, it's in just as good a shape as a lot in most of the uh, human ones, you know. So yeah, I'm not gonna complain about the condition. Over here at the brown Pet Cemetery by the Columbus Airport, and uh, almost mid-May already. For a guard ripping Harlow. Thanks for watching.